guys, it's Brianna, and today I'm showing you guys how to make some really cool fall decor. If you've seen my fall shopping haul, I said... Get ready for some fall decor. It's going to be on game. So in this video, as I said, I'm going to show you guys some fall decor. This is really easy, and mostly you can find the stuff at Target. If you guys like today's video, please give it a big thumbs up. And if you're not ready, please subscribe to my channel. So yeah, let's get started. The first thing is leaf garland, and you're going to first print out a leaf and cut it out. And then you're going to take a hole punch and punch a hole through the bottom of it. And then you're going to get some string, any color, and cut it to where you think it will be long enough. Because you need to hang it around a headboard and then string it around your loop. For this fall flower crown, uh, you saw it in my um, Halloween costumes video. You're going to need an old headband and some fake flowers and a glue gun. Take off the fake flowers and get a glue gun and hot glue them to your headband and that's it. Next up is this stick tray, and it's really easy. You're going to need to go into Mother Nature and pick up a bunch of sticks. If they're not already small, you're going to need to break them in half, and then you're going to set them in order like this. And now you're going to hot glue them together, and then you're done. Next up is a pumpkin vase, and this was actually kind of hard. In this clip, you can see my mom trying to help me with the knife. That's how hard it was. So we finally got it open with some scissors. And then once you get it out, finally, you're just going to get some more of those fake flowers and then just stick them in. And then you're done. Oh, look what you made me. Look what you made me do. What you just made me do, look what you just made me do. For the decorative acorn, you saw this in my fall shopping haul. You're going to need that wooden acorn, some brown paint, different colors, and a paintbrush. And you're just going to basically paint an acorn. And off camera, I added some black lines, and of course, I added glitter. And some washi tape on the edges. Now, I also had this in my fall shopping haul, and you're just going to need fall colors of paint and just decorate it however you want to. I was going for like a watercolor theme, but then I wanted to add glitter, which I wish I hadn't done. And now I definitely am going to make a different one and just keep it watercolors. <laughs> Next is a chalkboard wooden quilt. This is awesome. Look, everything is from my fall shopping haul. So you're just going to take a wooden plaque and some chalkboard paint. You do not have to use a foam brush, but that's what I had at the time. And just cover your whole thing like it's a canvas. Then you're going to take some chalk and start writing whatever you want. And as you can see, I started stopping and because it's paint. And I didn't let the paint dry, but let your paint dry. And final DIY is this fall crayon art, and it's just like regular crayon art, but it's with fall colors. You're just going to take off the wrapping paper of every fall color crayon and break them in half if it's too long, because mine are broken, some of them are. You're just going to line them up like this. And then you're going to take some masking tape and wrap it all around your canvas. Did I forget to say using a canvas? Use a canvas. Then get a blow dryer and set it to the highest heat you can. Put some newspaper around your workspace and just start blow drying. It might take a few minutes for it to start melting, but that's okay. I did it in my room because I didn't have an extension cord at the time, but maybe you could do it outside. I don't know. But that's basically it. And you can take off the masking tape and just leave it, but I didn't like how it was so plain, so I just hot glued the crayons on. Okay, guys, we got into the end of this video. Thank you guys so, so, so much for watching, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye!